to Food Trends TV. I am everyday innovator Dana McCauley and this is another episode of our 2015 summer flavor forecast. Today I want to talk about pickled fruit. Now it's no secret that uh, pickling has been a huge flavor trend for the last couple of years from all the cookbooks that have come out teaching people how to can and pickle to many 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 grocery store pickle launches you know the way that chefs and and uh, artisans have been jumping onto the pickling bandwagon is no secret what's interesting is that the whole idea of pickling is um, progressing and now this year in 2015 we're going to see the launch of a lot of new uh, pickled fruit products so there's two things that are going on here. The first is that um, cheese boards are of course very popular, they're a perennial favorite, but people wanting to make um, an entertaining statement, whether they're chefs or they are home cooks uh, or home entertainers, is um, becoming increasingly uh, desirable. And adding pickled fruits to a cheese tray allows you to you know, add a whole new dimension that you might not get with regular fruit or a chutney or whatever. The other thing that's going on is that a lot of the uh, up and coming ethnic cuisines, particularly Southeast Asian foods, uh, pickled uh, fruits have a long legacy there and um, are a great way to add yet another flavor dimension to that very complex cooking. So think uh, Indian lime pickle and uh, Sri Lankan uh, pickled mango and that kind of thing. So. That's what you can expect in the world of pickles this fall and into the winter. Pickled fruit, are you intrigued? Are you thinking of uh, looking at your apple tree a little differently? Tell me in the comments section below. Still hungry for information about flavor trends? Click here and you can see more episodes of this year's Midsummer Flavor Forecast. And if you click subscribe, we'll be able to stay in touch and you'll never miss another episode.